All right, let's do this new game. Also, if you haven't already, please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel because that would be really awesome. And there will be more to come. Sorry, I had to mute all of the copyright music for, you know, YouTubing reasons, but hopefully it doesn't ruin the entire experience. <sighs> Spooky. It's like too quiet, and that's annoying. <laughs> Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, uh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's dad, wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. Man. 
We need to find a couch for your yard one day. Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. I don't care. Hmm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know. Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of... Whoa. Good drawing, Lila. Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, Don't go to college. You heard Just of the internet? No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Talk to you soon as... You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad! Dad, Dad! What is this? Mm. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. He sucks. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Yeah. I have to do work in my room, too. Yeah? Don't hurry back. What a jerk. <sighs> okay. Let's get this party list started. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. I hope you guys can hear that okay. Cross that off the list. Food down, drinks to go. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. That you, Choco Thief? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure. Can't. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot. Must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. I can't read. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi for him. How's his leg? Well, you know. Old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey, I got it. I think. Hmm, <laughs> wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter.
Is that it? Yes. This is it. Yes. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Mmm. Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you... Like I'm going on tons of dates. Um, I mean... Yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay, have fun, but not too much. Bye. Love ya. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood, even though he won't tell. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Finally ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Serious talk. What are you... I don't know. Whatever. <sighs> so what? You're super cute. Sean! Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's, um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... <gasps> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? <laughs> That's a girl thing, no? Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. 
Ooh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it out. It might get your attention. Not taking a look at her picture? <laughs> yes, Sean. That's totally fucking obnoxious. Here's the thing. But where is it? It will wash off. You'll see. Whoa. No reaction, no like, no nothing? Hey, uh, I don't appear like a stalker or something. <laughs> okay, okay. Touche. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz! He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage! Pussies! You think you own the block? Dude, step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You're gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, <laughs> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! <sighs> Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <sighs> you and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! Uh, oh, what's going fuck on? Me. Daniel, get over here! Sean! Is he hurt? Okay! Okay, step away! Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating it. up my little on the brother! Ground. Now! Hands behind your Sean. head! Sean! This is fucking bullshit! Oh no. Sean! What's Get happening? On the ground, sir. Dad! We didn't do Sean, anything! Sean, be quiet! I swear! Oh, Sean! Dad. Listen! Oh. I'm sorry, Dad! Daddy! Just be quiet! I wanna go home! They're good kids, officer. Don't move! I'm sure they didn't do I anything! I said don't move! We didn't Daddy, do anything! It's gonna be alright! On the ground! Oh, shit! Okay, maybe that was too loud. I like the characters a bit more. I mean, they're 
choices are questionable, but... Oh, well. The reason I picked this game, though, is because I was playing Days Gone, and I just... I didn't like the military aspect of it. I think that there's enough of that in today's day and age. Not that I really want to convince anyone that the events of this game are much better. It was just kind of like a fork in the road. No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I would have told them to go to foster care. But it's still sad. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being... being in a home or... or in your room. This is a... a real adventure. Right? So... come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't dad with us, Sean? He Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I'm so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey. At least we don't have to go to school on Monday. Right? Yeah. I graduated. Look! Um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome pots. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, a Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We can be wolves. Yeah, yeah, that that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no, run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Blah!
this game needs is like a directional map. Like a map where you can just go through the, like the choices instead of watching the whole cutscene. <laughs> it's like too much. Or if you could like, yeah, just like unlock it where you don't have to go through the entire episode to see like how it affects them. If you could just like go through, you know, like a diagram and manually select it, then it'd be like two games in one. Damn, you can't even hear me. Okay, I'll try that again. What this game really needs is like an alternate mode where once you've cleared an episode you can just manually select all of the different pathways instead of playing through it as a cutscene because it takes like so long. I've already played this so that's why. I can't believe I wrote over my data. there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Oh, look! A car out here? It's another homeless. Man, Hope the driver isn't so around dirty. watching us. Homeless as heck. Huh? What are you? You know I love... Let's take this one. Come on, Daniel. The sun is going down. As long as you don't mind the... <laughs> Especially after you use it. John? Look how big these trees are. Eh, uh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh, I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Whoa, that place is huge. Ooh, Sean, let's play hide and seek. Bet you can't find me. No, not right now. We stick together. Ah, uh, you're no fun. Not today, I'm not. Sorry. Whatever. How am I gonna tell him the truth? Uh, hey! What if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet! Oh, man, raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah, but this one likes me! Until you run out of food. Let it... <gasps> That's one big <sighs> tree! Okay. Now it's your turn. Hop on down. I'll catch you. How come nobody is out here? Huh? 
It's October. People don't hike as much. So why are we? Because we can. We're badass warriors, dude. Cool. Pretty high up. Uh, Come on. I got you. <clears throat> uh, you see that? Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. We could build a really cool fort here, I bet. Daniel! Be right there! We're going to stay in there? I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. <laughs> cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. Yes. Uh, so what do we need? Okay, I, I needed to build a camp to keep out all those creepers and whatever. And I'll take care of finding the wood. Deal? Yes, I can build traps too. Nothing will get to us. Awesome, dude. I know. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. I really have no words for this game. This will be a really, like, chill experience. Even though the plot is, like, all wrong. Just gotta say no to violence. Oh, man. Our base is gonna be awesome. Look. <laughs> Coming! Let's see. Here's a good spot. One step and wham. Nice and dry. Or you could get adopted. Hey, this isn't too bad. I guess Daniel can chill a little. Hey, can you give me a hand? Yeah.
This is the best. Yo, what are you doing? I'm trying to move this branch to protect the base. Good call. That's a Here. lot. Okay. Let me take this side. You got it? We'll see. Go ahead and push. Can get in here now. Damn right. Nice work, Daniel. Cool. I'll go check the river. Look at him go. Done. No. Come on down. We got to Ah. Let me take care of this. I have bigger lungs. And a bigger mouth. I heard that. I didn't say whatever. I I could have. I wish we had cheese. Yesterday was yesterday. Now that we're out here, we have to do everything ourselves. Right? Okay. But you'll help me if I need it, right? That's what I'm here for. And you gotta help me too. We got in a fight. Did you kick his ass? Yeah, but nobody won. It's not like the movies, Daniel. It's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Uh, no. Dude, we are the wolves. Oh! See? Oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Okay. <sighs> I'm so over chips. Man, I made a fire tonight. That would be proud. Uh, I'm so tired. I could really use a smoke. We're almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? Get a job. I wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. How do I sleep? Now that's a fort. Good work, little bro. Still no reception. Of course.
I'm bored. Sean, can I play Mustard Party on your phone? Please. Dude, get real. The battery's almost dead, and we're gonna need it. <sighs> Daniel's a son. Uh, you look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. You're like yeah. A, a real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. Eyes won't stay open, son. Sleep tight, bro. Right here, in the park. Remember our amazing fire? Um, yeah? Are we okay? Uh, you fortified our base, so we're perfect. Um, I did. You're right. Go, go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might... <clears throat> you won't. I'm here. Just... Just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. This game is kind of sad. I mean, besides the fact that I can't get over my social anxiety to actually speak in this video, it just, it's overwhelming. Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. The Four Secret Milkshake Factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Oh. Like... Why are they in the wilderness outside? in the first Harry place? They to completely he left know, a civilization. With Harry, but he didn't like it. So he said he was going to get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. <sighs> I'm sorry, you know, no. I should have. Hey! There's something ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. I'm gonna get food, water, and plus a map so we can find the best route. All right. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but tonight will be better. I'm just gonna look at that poster, but whatever. This place is really creepy. But at least there's pumpkins. Hello there. Whoa! Sean! Hey! They have Shoto Crisp! Okay, 30 bucks. How do we spend it? The 
It's better than tap water. So the C four fifty. Watch where you're walking. Don't want mud all over my store. What? Can't go wrong with these. Six forty. Oh man, that is so cool. Bread. Jenny will sure. start this down. How are they gonna cook anything? I can't help but whisper. Why am I whispering? We can't make a fancy sandwich. The bread will be just fine. Six down is a sharp one. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, the bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> of course they did. What? Looks what? like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. Okie dokie. Ouch. Okay. We got that. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. Just another stray mutt. Aww. That's a she. Oh, right. Sorry, man. No way we're taking a dog with us. We need adults to take care of her, not kids. See? Sorry about that. Now let's go. Ooh, Sean, check it out. It's a raccoon costume. I want to be a raccoon. Let's see. Ten across. New generation. Okay. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see, what do we got here? This is a ton of food. I thought we were broke. Not today, Dan. So let's grub out. This is our choco. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. I deserved it. Guys lost? Uh, nah, we're good. Right on. Pro tip: don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, 
I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah. No way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday. But it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah. Okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. I don't know. All right. This is it. Are you sure? Yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Ah, uh, but it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it's okay. Look, our, our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, Don't touch my brother! That's exactly how episode 3 ended, and honestly, I'm not really seeing much right. progress in this series. <laughs> but it's fun. The gameplay's alright. Listen, I caught myself a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. No. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. But the story itself is kind of bananas. You will soon find stomach? out. It hurts. I didn't pop you that hard. You're all right. I, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Just let me use the bathroom. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. I'm suffering some green screen. Where's my brother? Effects. Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him. You think I'd hurt a little boy? Shit. Bastard turned the lights off. Come on. It's only plastic. what I thought. Fuck. Wonder if I could get more light from it. Yes. That's a little better. In reality, though, this guy's actually trying to protect their well-being by locating his parental figure and they are just like no you can't let us get adopted i was totally like that but what do you do Sean. daniel i'm right here are are you okay i i, I think so that old guy chased me into the woods but I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Inano. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? 
Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful, it might attract him. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. Give me the tools. It won't open, it's locked. What do I do? Of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Hold on, let me see if I can fix this. Uh, yeah. Can you try and open this vent? Yes. Ouch! It hurts! Sorry, Sean. I won't know. Don't worry. We'll figure something out. There, that should be a little better. Sean. Ish. I'm really scared. Don't be. I'm... I'm right here, okay? Just hold tight. Don't run off. What am I supposed to do? Give me a tool. Like, there's nothing I can do. Just try everything. Right. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys. Find me something sturdy. Enano? Let's do this. Finally, some gameplay. Yes! Good job, bro. hit you? Did he? No, he tried to grab me, but I got away. Okay, we need Drama. to cut this off fast. How about these? Dude, Brock, did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay, now we gotta get my stuff and go. Let's go, Sean! Uh... I am like... 
what happened? I'm losing valuable daylight what? hours. What did you do? How am I ever gonna get to episode four? I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. Just fucking leave. Move it. Let's go. Now. Come on. Come on. Wait. Shit. Where are we going? Sean. Watch out. Over there. L let's go. I don't know. Why did he freak out on us? Good question, my friend. There are a lot of messed up people out there. And you've thrown a little racism. Yeah. I don't think he was down with our last name. Welcome to Redneck Land. This ain't Seattle no yeah, more. I'm sure. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But <laughs> don't get just just stop. Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. How about a uh, mushroom? <laughs> Come on, that's not even a name, dude. But. I love mushroom, and you said it was my choice. Okay, okay, you win. <laughs> but this like one's kid just pilfered an animal yeah. for no reason. Thanks, big brother. See, mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. <laughs> What do you do exactly? Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money. But... So... How do you make money? <laughs> Spoken like a real American. <laughs> Just curious. Now that we're urban nomads too... If you have any tips... I sell shit. Like a good capitalist. Stories when I can. eBay when I can't. My biggest expense is gas and food, so it's easy. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, uh... I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? 
You okay to drive? Oh yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. And dangerous. You could hit an animal. Oh, there's no music because it's copyright protected. And I muted it. Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Daniel just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then, then fucking cops. <laughs> okay. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere, and you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? Wish I could go back to my town. Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends, family. I know. So then what's your plan? Should I go back to Seattle? Maybe I can try and explain everything. What happened? You should do what you think is best. Um, if going to Mexico seems like the right thing to do, then so be it. You're but... going in the right direction. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad... He always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, 
Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay. <sighs> so you've still got a long ways to go. We <coughs> got the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Listen, I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Holy shit, I've got a huge head. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. <sighs> okay, here. <laughs> Wash off. Okay. You can always get a burner later. You're not leaving? Okay, good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If you're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. Good. Oh, there's no way you can beat me, but ready? I am so ready to beat you. I won! <laughs> the pet is mine! I knew I'd beat you. See? And I knew you'd brag about it. Don't be salty. It's a fair win. Yeah, it is. I surrender. All right, I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pig Pen. I wouldn't be so sure, Cave Boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Oh, cool. Hot Dog Man is on. Oh, I remember this episode. Weird, it's on so late. Fill her up. It's so gross and dirty. Ew. Daniel will love this. What? R to aim and R2 to toss what? The water. Do you guys hear this? These people outside are obnoxious. All you can hear is their vehicle sometimes. And it gets on my nerves. Hey, Dad. 
Daniel. Bath's ready. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh, wow. So many bubbles. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he saw me. Yeah, let's just run Time away. Time to say throw goodbye to modern out. life. Dumb. You just gotta, like, be responsible. Oh, shit. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble, too. Sean? Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel with Daniel. Shit. Everyone's looking for you here. Fuck. I didn't do anything. I know. God, this is so messed up. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. You know I wish I could, but we can't take that risk. They're, they're gonna put me in juvie. Daniel... Oh, shit. You are innocent. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. I'm sorry. I guess... The freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So... Okay. Wait. Okay, okay. And... Action! Daniel! Wow. That's really smart of you. <laughs> Might have needed that. Okay. Don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Dance! Man, I... I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel... Uh... Come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? so dark it was an accident I fucked up and a cop shot him oh. no it's not true I'm so sorry why why did you lie to me? I just wanted to protect you until I protect could- Protect me for what? You? I- I hate you! Not my brother! Don't say that. I know I messed up everything. We're gonna get through this. Daniel, please! Oh. It's okay. <laughs> I want that. Oh, 
I promise I won't lie to you again. <laughs> gonna do without him Sean am I a monster nothing is wrong with you you're different Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking... Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where Dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. <laughs> he used to tell me bedtime stories too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world. There were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together. But, but one day, hunters took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone. And they had to find a new home. They started a journey. So yeah, that is Life is Strange Episode 1. Um, I think it's a pretty great game, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I am seriously losing daylight hours, and I refuse to buy an actual like beauty light display, so I'm unfortunately suffering some green screen malfunction action over there, and yeah, I had to replay the entire... Um, season because I accidentally went into like um, episode playing mode and it saved when all I was doing was getting the extra collectibles for the trophies and stuff so it's like uh, it erased it and then when I replayed it I went for a different outcome 
So, I mean, if you guys want, I can probably jump ahead a few episodes and then just carry on from there. Otherwise, it'll just kind of be like slowly churning out on my channel or on Facebook or something. So, um, yeah, I hope that you guys um, enjoyed this video and it wasn't too boring because, you know, I couldn't do anything else except for skip over everything. So, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I, I don't know. It's a, it's an all right, it's an all right entry into the series. I think I like season two more than season one and I did not play the other one. It's, I don't know. At the end of the day, it was just so much better than like military violence and like guns and like horrible, horrible stuff in Days Gone. I might show you guys that one just because of the zombie aspect of it is cool, but yeah, I don't know. Um, stay tuned. Follow me on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram if you want to. Subscribe, comment, like this video, and um, let me know what you guys think, and we will see what comes up in the future. So I will talk to you guys in the future, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. So, bye-bye.